Hi. <laughs> Hi. Welcome to Sass with Sabrina. This is the channel where I try one new thing a week and post however it has turned out. Hope to inspire you to try something new of your own or make you laugh through however my stuff turns out. Please subscribe and please hit the like button. I would greatly appreciate it. So in this week's video, I am trying origami. I have five different colored pieces of paper and I have the images that I want to create also. This is not the right type of paper. When I Google proper thickness of paper, there is a range and this paper that I just happen to have at home with, is within that range. Unfortunately, I can't find the thickness on the packaging. I guess I accidentally threw that piece out. I do know it is on the thicker end. So if you Google it, it ranges between 0.66 millimeters to 0.71. You do have to have square pieces. There are multiple things that you can use. Book pages, copy paper, gift wrap, newspaper, craft paper. Like that's just the basic info I've gathered just from a quick Google search. Again, I'm just Googling the things and I'm just trying, just try, try, try. Please try something new. It's so good for you. Let's get started. Well, all the papers are cut. From what I read, it should be seven and a half by seven and a half. I just made it square and I did eight and a half by eight and a half. So I'm just following step-by-step -step pictograph instructions online. I didn't read anything. I'm just going for it. Same as always. I don't even know if this is right. We'll find out, I guess. How do they... Yeah, that's right, okay. I'm guessing you have to make sure your folds are really like tight and strong. So back up and I'll show you. Okay, so step one, do a fold in half and then unfold it. Step two, do a fold in half and leave it like that. Create a fold halfway to that fold and then create a diagonal fold from the corner to the middle again and then the opposite way and then you just have to Fold it so that it's a arrow going up. And then you want this side. Oh, I folded that the wrong way. And then fold in half again. Your bottom half to the center without your top corner. I don't even know. This is so funny. Okay. Uh, middle. Middle. Open. But I can't figure it out. I might have to watch a video. Oh my god, I'm lost. This is definitely not a how to. Please Google it. <laughs> I'm starting over. So I am on to a different instructions. I'm on an instructional video. Fold it in half. You create your diagonal line on the top half. You create your diagonal line on the other side. And then you repeat for the bottom. Scrunch doodle the head in, and then, ah, oh, if you can, scrunch the bottom in. I think I have way too many folds in here now. Uh, fold your outer corner to your center on both sides. I'm guessing these are the feet. And then fold the inner to your outer, your inner edge to your outer fold of that little one you just created. Oh wow. How did anyone ever invent this? This is amazing. As you can see, my corners right there aren't actually meeting up. So I'm hoping that this goes well. Do the same on the top. So repeat all of that on the other side. Oh my god, I just noticed mine's completely wrong. This is correct, and this should be mirrored on this side, but 
Okay, so somehow, I did that completely wrong. So let's <laughs> start over, <laughs> folding it the proper way. Uh-huh, that's funny. Okay. Okay, so now it is completely mirrored from one side to the other. I'm just gonna adjust the camera. Okay, now flip it over and fold one end to the center. And now from your point here, fold... Wow, how did you do that? Fold all of it in to the center, but I am taking the leg with it. And you're not supposed to be. Wah, 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 big fail. <laughs> I failed at origami, that's so funny. I don't even know how this is supposed to be. This is supposed to be hanging out on the outside. So I'm just going to fold it as much as I can and I, let me watch that again. So that fold is supposed to be from the center point to that corner of that triangle you just made without affecting your frog legs. However, as you can see, mine are a mess. So I'm just gonna keep going and see how this turns out. I don't even, don't even know. This is hilarious. Two fold at the center point where all of the folds are and then another fold in that bottom half center point that you just folded up, if that makes any sense at all. And this is completely backwards. <laughs> oh my God, that is supposed to be an origami frog. First attempt at origami is a massive fail. That is not a frog. Moving on to the next one. I'm hoping this one turns out. I'm gonna try origami T-Rex. Fold on your diagonal. Repeat the other way. After you've done your diagonals, flip the paper over and then fold it in half. It looks like you're making an imaginary middle point from the middle to the edge and bringing your corner there. Leave that fold in and Bring the end of the paper to the edge of your fold. Bring your other end over. So I am watching Origami with Joe Nakamishima. I'm sorry I butchered that last name. It's a YouTube channel, but he's amazing. So then open that back up and this one. So with these previous folds you have created you want to uh -huh, so with this previous fold that you have coming up you want to recreate that and pull the center down so you have a little oh wow and then open that up fold that so many folds I don't understand this is so funny Fold right across and then fold that top over to match and have it again. Oh no, I hope this one turns out. So open it, flip it, gather those outer folds together and then fold this up. Repeat on this other side. Turn it over. Repeat by using the outer folds. Fold this down and out. You don't want those lined up, you want it angled out. Repeat on the other side. Fold the top corner on each little, I don't know, like a centimeter of it in. And now reverse it. It's actually not supposed to hang over the 
tip like that. What did I do wrong? And then bring your bottom point to the middle. Foldy schmoldy. Bring that one to the fold line you just created. Grab this and fold it at the point where these are. Open it back up. Fold the center. Find your middle way fold there. And fold that down. Oh, so the space between your two folds, you are going to fold that down on an angle. Basically, you want to make an L. Open it up so that you can pop that back out. <laughs> this is so funny. <laughs> I can't get the head. So you, your two folds that are down are gonna come up and in. I'm lost, I'm lost. I get it, but I don't get it. How did you do that without unfolding it all? So use those, the folds that you just created as your guide. This is so hard, okay. <laughs> I don't know, somehow make that look pretty. I'm like a T-Rex head. I have no clue what I'm doing. Argami fail, two times in a row. Ooh la la, who knew paper was so hard to work with? <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna keep that little weird thing. Cause I have no idea. Okay, looks like a Loch Ness monster. So go to the back side, open it up, and you should have a fold that you're gonna use. I'm folding it backwards. Okay. My fold is too high, so I'm going to create a new one. Okay, now it looks like a seahorse. That is so funny. Okay, so these are his bottom legs, and this is his tail. And you are somehow supposed to fold these little corners so that they are his arms that hang out. Um, it was the tiniest little thing and I can't even do that. Oh, he's right messed up. He's way off. <laughs> so then you're supposed to fold pointy beak in by half. Recreate that fold line that is there and then fold the bottom point of the feet up so it's like a foot. Repeat on the other side. That's just not right. And then it gets cute little ripples in his tail. It is relaxing. I'm sure if you could uh, follow instructions better than me, it would be, <laughs> it would, uh, be very rewarding in the end. I'm going to leave that like that. There are a couple more steps that you do with the little tiny T-Rex hands. However, this is already just too far gone on its own. So, fail number two. So I have all my thicknesses of paper. So I have three, I have, oh my gosh, start over. One, two, three, four. Thanks so much for watching my video. Please subscribe, watch on repeat, like, and share. Sass it up!